Darren versus Melissa. Right. I'm holding my head to shame. Alright, All right, boys. Alright, the next battle we have is Darren versus Melissa. You're gonna make the bigger picture in the Hall of Shame. I'm trying to see who's gonna be the Hall of Shame. We're gonna get some frames to fit on the wall. Uh huh. <laughs> so every customer that walks in the store will see the Hall of Shame. That he wants. Yeah. Shh. Alright, we got Kirby on Darren's side and. Daisy slash Peach on Melissa's side. And they're playing in the Mushroom Kingdom, which seems very suiting for Melissa. <laughs> yeah. I figure she likes using uh, Princess Peach, so she thinks she's a princess. Thanks, Kippy! <laughs> but she's not. <laughs> the way I see it, Peach be giving up to everybody. <laughs> hey! <laughs> you know my husband's in the <laughs> <laughs> I think it's at 78%. Well, I was Kirby's at zero. And he, it looks like he's going for the suicide dog. But it didn't work out well. The bullet bill is going to get Peach, it looks like. Kirby ain't going to do the damage. <laughs> the explosion almost got him, but the really close at 12% on Kirby and 84% on Peach. This is a pretty close battle. It seems like we're not seeing any kills on either end. Two minutes on the clock still. He wants his paycheck, he's gonna be. They're just exchanging, they're showing off their no, big weapons and tools. Hey, Kirby, you're having trouble landing the hit, and he finally gets a hit on her. Melissa's taking a lot more damage than Darren, a lot more damage. But she's still holding her own. Kirby's still holding her own. Darren has trouble landing them hits, because she's KO'd. Kirby's and she looks like she's getting a little fancy there. She's doing a little dance. And he goes down with a rock move. And the channel, the, the game is chanting Kirby, but I don't know if it should be that way. Because it really looks like Daisy's got the advantage. She keeps flinging them all over the stage. And she gets a kill, like I said, she has the advantage. Oh, but they exchange still now they are back. Even one to one. At one minute, one minute and ten seconds left on the clock. Kirby's got the percent on him more than and that puts her in the lead by 50%. The bullet bill is coming in to do some damage, and if she stands around too long, they're gonna take the damage. They're just hiding out. They're like, I can't figure out what side I'm gonna be on. All right, so we're going back at it at 8% on Kirby. Kirby's advantage, 66 on Kirby. Let's see if Kirby has 27 each. She's coming down with the beat down, trying to hit her hard, but she get her knocked out, but she can't go through the stage platform. There you go, he gets it. And he falls to his own death. Oh no, he doesn't. He's back with a quick recovery. A little too short on the hammer. Yeah, she avoided it. And she fell off the stage. Then I thought things were. I guess we can probably blame that on the controller stick. I liked it too, but that was on day one. That's what I'm actually doing right here. Alright, at 125, Kirby and 28% Peach. At seven seconds, I'm not 100% who's in the lead. We will check it in this battle. Two seconds, one second, and 145.59, and it puts Kirby in the lead, which puts Darren. Still in the lead in the bracket, but he won that particular battle. All right, we have two minutes, or right, three minutes on the clock, and we're fighting at Lake Termia, if I'm not mistaken. The turtles are nice. But, uh, Which is yes, Kirby is trying to rack that damage up. You just don't want to Daisy's got 47. And Kirby is coming in there hard. But it looks like Melissa's really got the advantage in the battle. She got easy kill. This, is, this does not seem like it is there in stage. It seems like Melissa has it under control. As they keep going at it, Kirby keeps trying to get some easy hits from the B down, trying to smash, resort to the same move. Up there! Problem sometimes. He has to control it. Come on, fill the witch's bag. 120% on a Melissa. Remember, I'll keep my. I did, Trudy. Oh, it's really good. I'm going to take it and save the toast. 
140 down on the clock. Terry's trying to get those moves. He's sucking. But I don't know if he's sucking the game, but he's trying to get his moves. And we have another ball. Remember, this is not the new Super Smash Brothers, so you cannot swim. <laughs> and she keeps trying to swim. She's like a cat in water. We got 23% on. Alright, 69% on Kirby and 23 on Daisy, but I'm pretty sure that Daisy slash Peach is falling behind from the falls. She's got one twelve on the clock, one ten on the clock. So we come back to her feet down, trying to catch up from there, do a couple quick punches and kicks. Floating up. She's trying to hit him on the head button and she's gonna fall to the stage again. For real At this point I think that we already know who the winner is. We know who the winner is, thanks guys. It's gravity. We know who the real employee of shame will be. Take to the battle. Oh, yeah, this is the time for the shame. There's no shame, I'm on my head of eye. 27, 24. The way that looking at you, yes, that's true. Well, that's Majora's mask. From Majora's mask. And she still thinks she can swim. She is definitely the cat in water in this battle. That's what's up. I've heard somebody that gets a kick. Punches doesn't matter because he has so many kills or he has so many stops to his advantage. He needs to be down, but he's coming back down. At this point, they're just riding out the clock again. It's five, four, three, two, one. And that was an easy determination because somebody can't swim. <laughs> three and seven. 